This NAB Spotlight is powered by Switcher Studio, a multi-camera, live, video production studio that fits in your pocket. Hello there, my name is Anthony Barocas. I am here at NAB 2019 for Streaming Media Producer. We're here with Andrew in the Lytra booth, and you guys make lights, but Last year we talked about this little torch light, but now you've got an, an, you know, an update to this yeah, light. An update, it's a Torch 2.0. So what is different between the Torch and the Torch 2.0? Because it so looks the it, same. It looks a little different. You look at the face, there's now 16 LEDs instead of 8. And we'll get to our Pro light, but we took the precision optic lens from the Pro, added it to the Torch so that there's less glare. Okay. We changed the beam angle to 70 degrees from 80 to get a little more throw. Okay. We increased the CRI, so the color balance is much better. It went from 78 to 94. Wow, that's a huge it's a difference. huge improvement. Puts it into that pro-grade lighting. Yeah. Then we increase the waterproof rating from 30 to 60 feet. 60 feet. I, I, my camera wouldn't survive to that, but I'm glad my light could survive down to that depth. Now, we it, re, then it's the same housing, so the same dual quarter 20s and the magnet on the back. Right, right. And then the accessories all right there. Right there. The accessories all still fit the same, so if someone has a, a original torch they want to upgrade, right. their color filters or the smartphone mount or any of the accessories they've purchased will work with the 2.0. Now you were talking about better color balance. I, I think we should you know, say we actually added, we swapped out our normal lights, so you're looking at the, the torch, the, no not the torch, the this we're Lytra looking, Pro. The Pro is illuminating us right now and the Lytra Pro we're using through the softbox, which I think is a really nice advancement as well because you know, you can have a small point source of light, but a lot of times you just wanted to soften that out a little bit. So Absolutely. I think I think this softbox really does make the the little light perform like a much bigger light. The idea is to have a very small light that's rugged and durable and everything needs to match that. So this not only is it lighting us well, but it breaks down. So this all comes apart very easily and all these blades pull out and then it would pack flat. We provide a little bag with a padded divider to protect the, the screen. Okay. But this breaks down to be about a half inch thick and that that size. Right. We so throw it in your backpack and go. When you get there, you can set up, put this thing together. Just pop these blades back in and put the cover back on just like this. So I think we'll face the camera. You're taking the, the concept of a very compact solution and carrying it through to the accessories as well. Absolutely. Now, one of the things that I really liked about the Pro is it's, it's uh, you want to say bicolor, but it's... It's bicolor in the tungsten range from 3,000 to 6,000 K. Okay. You adjust it in 100 K increments. You can also adjust the output in 5% increments as far as brightness. Mm -hmm. So right now the one you're holding is at 5%, that's 60 lumen. This is 5%. That's 5%, that's, wow. si that's 60 lumen. <laughs> if, if you zip it up to 100%, you're at 1,200. Now, so I'll hold this what. and you were saying you can actually do this remotely via an app. Yes, so you'll hold that and I'll show this so the camera can see it. This is the app and that lights at 5%. You might want to tilt it away from your face a little bit and I'm going to turn it way up <laughs> to 100%. Oh! 1200 lumen, I'm going to tip it back down. And right now he's very tan, that's 3000. Okay, I'll bring it up to 6000 so we'll go to a very cool 6000. Bump it back right here, we're at, we're at daylight right there. And, I, and now I have my settings saved and I want to, maybe it's on a light stand up high or something. I want to put it to sleep, I just hit blackout, I turn the light off, the OLED display, if you tip it towards the camera, is stored my settings and also stored here, so when I turn it back on, it's going to go right back to where it was. Also on here, I have my battery indicator, so if this thing's on a light stand, I know what the battery life is of the oh, light. Oh, that's slick. So, and this has a much larger battery than Torx, 2500 right. uh, milliamps versus 1400, so this light will run at this setting 10 hours, at the mid setting, which would be about here, run 5 hours. And at high, which I'll do for a second, it will run for 50 minutes, so almost an hour at 1200 lumen. So, so that is, you don't have to connect I'll, external you know, batteries to it, that's really nice. And can the app talk to more than one light? The app can talk to seven lights, or you can group them, all seven in one group to control them, so independently or in a group, and you can actually do three separate groups. So if you want to say three in the front, two mid, two rear, you can create mid, front, mid, rear groups. So you can, use, you can have just back lights, just a hair light, and yeah. just talk to the hair lights, and then have something in the front as well. Absolutely, and then control wow. them separately. And this light is waterproof to 90 feet. So it'll go much deeper than your camera, <laughs> like you said, but you know, if someone wants to take it scuba diving with, with a GoPro, yeah, yeah, yeah. they can do that. That is very cool. Well, thank you for giving me the walkthrough of the new lights. And you may have seen behind us, we you, won. Just a few awards. We won a few awards yesterday. We <laughs> took best in show in government video, best in show in digital video, 
and then the uh, British Columbia Professional Videographers Association gave us an innovation award. That is so, very cool. So, so we're getting well recognized and we brought a whole van full of gear thinking we'd bring some back and put it back in our warehouse and we sold out early in the show. So we've well, had a really good response. It, it goes to show you that people really do value the innovation and the compactness and the ease of use. Here we are at NAB 2019 in the Lytra booth. You can check him out. What's the web? Lytra.com. Lytra.com. My name is Anthony Barocas here for Streaming Media Producer. Thanks for watching. Thanks, Anthony. This NAB Spotlight is powered by Switcher Studio, a multi-camera, live video production studio that fits in your pocket.